Hello beautiful people, you welcome back to our channel. And you know the family at Lokyoki. The goddess actress has been in the industry for decades and sadly passed on due to a cardiac arrest, but her legacy seeks to be celebrated forever. Moji Olaya started acting in movies at a pretty late age, and by the time she started, she had an eight year old daughter, Adun, where she was a single parent, but all the hurdles didn't stop the late actress from achieving her wildest dream. The achievements which are not only hers but a legacy with which our children will survive by and cherish it forever. Mojolaya was born on the 27th of February in 1975. She is the niece of one of the most rated musicians, Victor Olaya. G. Olaya passed on in 2017 due to cardiac arrest. And she also lost her brother, Alfred Olaya. The actress was survived by her siblings and her elderly mother and two daughters. Her aged mother, Mrs. Abosedi Olaya, recently opened up in an interview with Biodo Alao, or now she has been coping and taking care of the deceased daughters. She finds it hard that they are both gone, but believes that God had a plan. And a message was wrote to Moji Olaya. Dear Moji Olaya, though dead, not everyone will forget you. At least your friend, Fuluke Daramula Salako, has accepted that she hasn't been up and doing towards your kids, Adun and Murokweda, as expected, but has promised to make amends. But then, what about other colleagues in Nollywood? Who were Ashwebi with you to the many parties and premieres you all attended together when you were alive? To even congratulate Adun when she graduated from Babcock was a call to some of your colleagues. Some can even send a birthday shout out to your daughters anytime they celebrated after your dad and was interred in 2017. Well, Murakbada is five and Adun at Adun Farumbi is doing a fantastic job with grandma to care for this beautiful little girl. I hope I am not a busybody writing this to you, but it's a reminder that not everyone who is all over you while alive does such to your family, especially children, when you are no more. Rest on, don't forget to always be there in spirit when these girls need you. This is so sad. Moji Alaya began her acting career with Wali Adenuga's production on the film of Super Story, where she stayed and she has also stayed in several Nollywood movies from different productions where she had to act in English and Noruba. And since 20, 2003, she was collecting awards and getting nominated throughout and she was nominated for the real award best supporting actress of the year and she won the best new actress award which was quite a milestone and built a solid portfolio and it later on showed what directors theater started calling her for their upcoming movies and projects moji had a career breaking when she banked a leading role for No Pains No Gains, in which she played Iriti in 2005. The actress had also herself had another role on the drama movie Shade Blade. In 2018, she had yet another role for Nkwadu and Omoyame Talei, which was released in 2008. She also stayed in the Agumbani role. The sky wasn't never the limit for Muji. She was always aimed high. In 2016, she released the film Iya Okome, starring the most talented Foluke Daramola and Funshua Diolu, which was scheduled to premiere in Lagos on July. But she didn't live long to see the success that the movie is making now in the film industry. Moji was married to the businessman Bayo Keshola in 2007, but later got divorced. A divorce is said to be through domestic violence which she endured during her marriage and she has two daughters Adunulua who was born Adunulua was born on the 25th of february and Morok Beda was born on march 17 2017. this was two months prior to her death and according to mrs keji on what led to her death 
A baby was born premature. A EDD was for May 2017, but complications arose that necessitated that she be induced to save the baby's life as well as us. But since the delivery in March, her health had, been, had not been exactly perfect, and she died in the ambulance on her way to the hospital. She spent so much years in the entertainment industry, which has allowed her to set a beautiful milestone for her children. Moji firstborn Adun Olua Farumbi has shown a strong and courageous side with her YouTube channel, which is one of the first growing channel. As she gets older, she accepts death but always writes messages to comfort her during the anniversary of her mother's passing. Two years ago, today marks the day since you've been gone and I don't know how I've been able to continue without you. You are my backbone. Your passing is still a very sensitive topic for me. Anybody that knows me knows that I don't like, I don't talk about it. What can explain how much I miss you? Adolua Farumbi. A death took the Nigerian entertainment realm by a sudden wave. Some of the people who shared their sentiments upon a death were the Nigerian famous filmmaker, Kunle Afolanyo and Nollywood actress Kate Henshaw. She shared that she was a huge fan of Muji. The mother, Mrs. Abosede or Laia, talking about her late daughter's unfulfilled dreams. She said her major dream in life was to send Adun abroad for her master's after her graduation from the university, not knowing that man proposes and God disposes. I thank God I strongly believe that that dream will be fulfilled in Adun's life. She also talked about what he has faced since her daughter died he said like i said earlier it has not been easy at all tribulation and challenges will surely come in different angles but i give god almighty the glory because we always overcome god is faithful moji olaya continue to rest on and to her mothers may we not labor in vain and may the lord god continue to care for your children amen Please don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and also to click on the red notification button and also to comment at the comment section below.